Well, hi, friends. Yeah, Doc South here. And, gee, pretty soon uh, it's my wife Sandy's birthday uh, coming up uh, in, in the next you know, few days. And I, I've got to say, <laughs> i got to hand it to that girl. I'm, I'm a pretty lucky guy. Uh, she is so enthusiastic about various things in life. And I, I just find it, uh, I find it a pleasure to watch her... <laughs> go whole hog into various endeavors. Uh, it's, uh, well, for a while, she was very big into Taekwondo, and I think still is, uh, but she really was into it, you know, becoming an instructor, uh, building herself up to a rather, uh, well, a reasonable level of black belt. Uh, it, it's, it's, it's just amazing how she, <laughs> I, I know you'd see her in the in the mornings uh, sometimes. She'd be out, you know, just as the sun's coming up, uh, doing her exercises out in the yard and, uh, you know, like that, yeah. And um, I know when um, eBay first started, we, we, we went and got a computer, one of the old-fashioned ones, and she'd be doing eBay like, uh, you know, just insanely. I mean, to the point where she was actually selling about as much on the computer, on the web, as we were selling in the store. Yeah, only much less overhead. It was, it was something. <laughs> and it's, it's, I don't know, I find it really fascinating, really fascinating. And, of course, her uh, big thing now is buying and selling antiques. And uh, she's very good at that doing clean outs and getting, uh, you know, if a person has uh, a, a garage they need cleaned out or something, she often will. Uh, maybe not a garage, but a basement or an attic. She'll uh, take care of that, uh, you know, and <clears throat> get her, possibly get some antiques in the process. And th then next thing you know, it could be, it could be two in the morning and she's out in the, in the, uh, in her work area, uh, cleaning up uh, uh, maybe a table that she's going to take up to her uh, fl indoor flea market booth up in Slatington, Pennsylvania. You know, and, and she's, she's very um, helpful to all the people that work there and the various other vendors. Uh, she, she just hits with a vengeance. It's so, so cool to see. And I got to say, I'm, I admire the enthusiasm. It's really, it's very cool to say. Very cool to say. Uh, consider myself a lucky guy. And um, <laughs> but, but, I don't know, sometimes two in the morning, three in the morning, she's uh, heading out the door to, <clears throat> to, so she can get to a, one flea market or another as the sun comes up. Or she'll plot a route, uh, if, you know, hitting various garage sales. Uh, on a on a given Saturday or a Friday or whatever, it's in and and always doing everything very honestly too, which I think's and that's that's really cool. Good girl. Her birthday coming up soon. I have no idea what to get her. No, it's uh, she. <laughs> I can't get her an antique. She has like thousands of them. One more antique and the house is going to explode. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. I get her a pie, or so. But trouble is, she may not eat the pie. She she believes in staying thin, which again is good. Yeah. So I'll eat the pie, dog owner. I guess so. Anyway, I'll see you later, friends. But I just thought I'd, uh, I just thought I'd, uh, yeah, lay a little on you about that wife of mine, good old Sandy. And again, birthday coming up soon. She's a whole lot younger than I am. Yeah. I don't know, just, I don't, I guess she must be now, it must be in her early 60s, I would think, somewhere in that neck of the woods. <sighs> Me, older than dirt. Yeah, I know, I know. <sighs> anyway, uh, I, I just thought, again, happy birthday to her, a real sweetheart. We'll see you. Bye now, friends. God bless.